Alright, so these are the Air 2 Pro by Xreal. They're AR glasses. Think of them as a wearable display. You connect them to your phone, your tablet, your gaming console, your computer, and they give you an immersive virtual experience. See, they've got the latest 0.55 inch micro OLED displays from Sony that, when you put these on, appear as a big screen that can get up to 330 inches. Yeah, on a pair of glasses you can fit in your pocket and take with you anywhere. And I mean anywhere. <clears throat> These completely change the way you view your media, whether you're gaming, getting work done on your computer, or watching TV shows and movies. I'm super excited to be partnering with Xreal to show you what these are all about. Let's take a look. So in the box you'll get a hard shell carrying case, the glasses themselves of course, a prescription lens frame, a set of nose pads, you get small, medium, and large, you get a cleaning cloth, a light dimmer, and a USB-C cable. The glasses themselves are well made. On the bottom of the right side you'll find some controls, there's a power button that doubles as the mode select for the electrochromic dimming feature, and a brightness control that doubles as a volume rocker. On the left side is where the charging port lives. Uh, you'll also find two speakers, one on either side. They sound surprisingly good, not gonna lie. Uh, there's a dual omnidirectional microphone array. Uh, there's a sensor in the middle that detects when you take the glasses off and put them on. The nose pads sit right below that. They're easy to remove and install, which is nice. And the glasses actually have three different temple positions. So use these along with the different nose pads to help you get the best fit and the best image. So what exactly are these for and why in the world would you want to use them? Check it out. If I plug these directly into my phone, it mirrors my phone's display. Now this is what they call air casting. It's great for streaming media like movies, shows, live streams, and YouTube videos. This will work with any device that supports video output via USB-C and DisplayPort. That means I can plug this directly into a handheld gaming console like a Steam Deck, ROG Ally, GPD Win 4, and more, and it'll work. I can also plug them directly into my MacBook to get some work done on a larger canvas, and using the Nebula app application allows me to get an additional second and third display if I want, which is awesome. I can have three desktops open for the ultimate workstation at home or on the go. Another great use case is plugging these into a Galaxy device to use with Samsung DeX. This just makes so much sense because you get that desktop-like experience and not only will a phone, wireless keyboard, and mouse take up less space than a laptop, but this makes for a great mobile gaming setup paired with a Bluetooth controller and emulation. If you know, you know. Emulation with iOS devices took a big step forward recently, so that'll work great here too, but you get the point. This is awesome. Having a display at up to 130 inches at up to 120 hertz for all of these different use cases is pretty awesome, and it really is plug and play. Now, since the glasses don't have their own battery, they rely on the connected device for power. Sold separately is this, the Xreal Hub. This allows you to keep that connected device charged up so you can continue using the glasses for extended periods of time. And it's with this adapter that I can plug the Air 2 Pro into my Switch for some casual gaming and what's crazy is that the Switch doesn't need to be docked as the hub essentially acts as one. I can just plug it in, detach the Joy-Cons or break out the Pro Controller, and it works. It's seamless, the image looks fantastic, it's bright and colorful, and the latency, or lack thereof, is excellent. This is easily my new favorite way to play the Switch. Okay, now it's time to kick things into high gear. That's where this comes into play. This is the beam. Not only does this have a super clean aesthetic that I I really like, actually, it's got an eye-catching design, but it makes it so that you can use the Xreal Air 2 and Air 2 Pro with a PlayStation 5 or an Xbox, which is great. You will need a proper HDMI to USB-C cable for that, and in addition to that, the Beam unlocks three extra viewing modes, which you can use with the devices I already mentioned throughout the video. You use this orange mode select button on the left to swap between them, and you use the directional pad to adjust screen size and distance after you've pressed 
past that button. It's super simple. You get body anchor, which keeps the display locked in its set position when you're looking around. Smooth follow keeps the display from bouncing and jittering around when you're riding in a car or on a bus or a train, stuff like that. These are the two modes that support the virtual screen size up to 330 inches. And then you get side view, which shrinks the virtual display down to 20 inches and you can choose a corner to place it in. This is great for multitasking with IRL tasks. So if you're cleaning the house, you're cooking, doing laundry or something like that, you can keep a small window open. It's pretty neat. The Beam is actually a bit of a standalone device. It's got its own UI, it's got support for certain Android applications, and you can use it as a little portable TV box. It's got 32 gigabytes of onboard storage, so you can download a whole season of that show you're binge watching for when you travel. The Beam has a 4,870 milliamp hour battery battery which adds three and a half hours of extra use. There's a battery level indicator up top and it supports 27 watt charging so you can juice it up to halfway in 30 minutes. This thing, it, it takes the experience with these glasses to the next level. It is, it is highly recommended. Now there is quite a bit of the latest and greatest technology crammed into the Air 2 Pro. You've got those Sony micro OLED displays that get up to 120 hertz as I mentioned earlier. They come in at 500 nits, 1080p resolution per eye, they provide a 46 degree field of view, and they just push out a very impressive high quality image with great color reproduction. They actually put a lot of care into calibrating these things. In fact, these are the world's first TUV color accuracy certified AR glasses, which means with these you're getting a display that rivals a professional grade monitor in terms of color accuracy. You get a clean, natural yet colorful look and good contrast. And then you get the electrochromic dimming that lets you dial in your preferred level of immersion by reducing ambient light for different indoor and outdoor conditions. The speakers, like I said earlier, sound surprisingly good considering their size and their placement. Uh, they use directional audio, which makes it so that you can hear things clearly without it really bothering people around you. Okay, so the Air 2 Pro have honestly been great to use. I'm a big fan of being able to have multiple desktops for getting work done on my computer. It's like having a huge monitor setup but one that I can take literally anywhere. I like listening to, searching for, and organizing music while I edit videos, so I have Spotify open and my notes and whatnot on another desktop. I've started using them while playing piano as I attempt to learn new music and how to record it. I love the gaming aspect of it all, with console gaming, mobile gaming, and emulation of course. And the entertainment side of things has been a blast, whether I'm watching streams, shows, movies, or the NBA playoffs, you already know. I got how to do that with these. And what wraps it all together, again, is the fact that I can do this anywhere and however I want. Being able to literally sit back, look up, and chill while gaming or watching YouTube without contributing to my already rapidly developing nerd neck is pretty sweet. First world problems, I know, but laying down while watching late West Coast games that end at like 1am my time isn't super comfortable. But with these, I can watch games on my ceiling. I love it. And best believe I'm going to be taking these with me when I travel later this year. Not only will I have a big display at my disposal, but I won't have to worry about propping my phone up or whatever. I can just wear these. You really got to try these for yourself. They're enjoyable. They're entertaining. They look good. They're not ugly. They're comfortable with a lightweight and ergonomically friendly build. Just all the things. Kudos Xreal. Kudos. Xreal is the world's best selling AR glasses brand for good reason. I've got links in the description if you're interested in checking out the Air 2 and the Air 2 Pros. Oh, and there's the Beam and the Hub. Those are must haves. Go find all the information you need and the latest pricing there too. It's been Zach, and thank you so much for watching.